I know that you don't know that I know, but I know that you know yeah. that I know. I'm like, you know? <laughs> <laughs> it's real. <laughs> Strain. Strain. <laughs> Linty. Come on, man. Penciled in five year plan. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> He's just the ash. Yeah. He's getting better. He is. So what I thought is like while we're just doing stuff, whether you could just come over with the camera yep. and ask some of the questions I'm to like us. The, I'm the host. Yeah. Oh. But like yeah. you're a secret host. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and maybe after two or three, you might get a chance to maybe we can sit down <laughs> yeah, and do this yeah. vlog. The first ones, you'll be like, what's going on? Yeah. Perfect. People have gone wild. So wow. I'll let you have the camera. Okay. Have the questions. Maybe have a little right. read through and laugh at some yeah. of them. Hi guys. Oh, I love this first one. The first one is from Lindsay McCullen. Hi guys. So, Hi. we're just going to do a quick little question, Ash, and it's just from me, basically. I just quite like to know this. So, I've just been thinking recently, and so has Lindsay McCullen. <laughs> um, <laughs> when did you first realise you had feelings for Jay? <laughs> Great question. Straight in there. Straight <laughs> Lindsay, come on, man. Personally, it's so hard to put like a definite mm -hmm. black and white sort of date thing on it. The only thing I can say is when I was overcome with love mm -hmm. for Joanna, it was LA. I was, yeah, I was, I was so, say so when we was out in LA, like we spent a lot of time together and whatever out there, I kind of feel like maybe feelings I had suppressed or not thought about before. When I was in LA, I went through a bit of a spiritual journey, should we nice. say. Nice. <laughs> and my, and then my, my love for Joanna came to my consciousness then, I think. That's brilliant. You answered when we were first sexually attracted to him. On your 18th birthday. <laughs> What a great first question. <laughs> I think, guys, if you go back as well, if you watch the vlogs in America, a, a, a very definite change in Ash and Joanna's how they were together. It's, it's beautiful, really beautiful to watch. Hi, guys. <laughs> Just a second question. Me and Jenny have been chatting. <laughs> and, right, so the next question, me and Jenny, we had a right good chat yesterday. <laughs> we, were going around oh, Asda, Jenny. we were going around Asda together. <laughs> and we discussed and we said, when you're looking at living, moving in together, that sort of situation, is, is that close? Are we, are we far away? We've, we discussed it. We've got off penciled in five-year plan. <laughs> Look at his face. Ten years. Where you've <laughs> well, got another five years to go. <laughs> Obviously, Joanna's already got her own place mm -hmm. where she plans on staying for the time being. The idea is that, like, hopefully in a year or so time, I get my own place and then we move in together into a new place. So rather than me moving into Jay's apartment now or flat, would you call it a flat or a house? Dual story flat. Rather oh, like than me that. moving into Joanna's dual story flat. <laughs> And it's almost like me moving into her space or whatever. If I get a house, she moves into my house. And I feel like it's fresh and it's new and it's exciting for us to both move into a, a place together and move into our house rather than into one of each other's. Hi guys, just having a cup of coffee, are you? Yeah. I just thought, uh, me and Nicole. Where are you getting all these new friends from? Oh. Well, you and Joanna have been so close recently. I've like needed new friends. <laughs> <laughs> so, the next question. When did you guys first kiss? And uh, linked to that, what was Niall's reaction? Can I answer this one? So, we first kissed in fibre, mm -hmm. bottom fibre, and I was 19 and Ash was 25. And basically, it was at a period in Niall's life which is when he didn't drink. Wow. Often drove for a night out, would come out and then sort of drive home early and it was also a period of time where me and um, my best friend Catherine would sort of just get crash everyone else's nights out. So we had two of the guys over who competed for the Netherlands in gymnastics. Snitches. But they came out, it was basically us taking them out into Leeds so there was like you and a couple of other gymnasts. Niall had gone home and Niall wasn't in fibre anymore. So Ash pounced. I feel like Joanna pounced. Joanna did pounce um, but Ash didn't say no. <laughs> Take me. <laughs> it's, it's quite an interesting one because we spoke earlier in the vlog if you guys remember me and uh, Lindsay we were discussing when you first had feelings, Ashley. Jo Joanna, was that when you first had feelings? Before that, possibly? I feel like girls might um, agree with me on this one. You know when like girls might say like I'm gonna marry him to like even even from being a young age like about a guy that they just like close with or his family friend or his whatever I feel like I've always said that about Ash since being like a kid I've been obsessed with Ash since being a kid so going back to the story Ash was like please don't let's second 
Please don't tell Niall. Please don't tell <laughs> Niall. Please don't tell Niall. But little did you know, I'd already told him because I messaged him immediately and said, she, oh my wh God. While, while we're kissing, she's out. Literally, I was like, <laughs> I'm kissing Niall. <laughs> I remember car journeys to gym, Niall's driving and me sat there being like, does he know? And then he's like, does he know that I know? know? Yeah. It was like friends. It, was, it was literally knows. that, man. But it didn't come out until like the year after on your birthday. I know that you don't know that I know, but I know that you know yeah. that I know. And I'm like, you know? <laughs> <laughs> By the next one. Sony's saucy questions. Oh, saucy stories. Saucy stories. Sony's saucy. Maybe that's something that we. Sony's saucy stories. <laughs> right, guys. The yeah, next one. On me and Alice. Alice. Uh, Alice Gibbo. I call her Gibbo. Gibbo. <laughs> it's it's got to be difficult to balance a work and relationship. Right. You know, the balance. How, how, how do you do that? I don't think it's difficult. Obviously, of course, it's all going to merge mm. into different aspects of our life. I don't see any issues with it. We spend a lot of our time talking about the group when we're together rather than about each other and work. But it's something we're working on. How do you how do you separate work That's a great and question. relationship? That's a great question. Because obviously, you, you know, you want to have you and Joanna time. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's something we're, we're currently working on. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. trying to separate it. Because I suppose as well, this can link to Joanna. That question is we don't. Because obviously, you do a lot of vlogs and when you're together, I suppose, it's got to be difficult to separate the relationship. It's like, oh, we're together, so we might as well get some content. Well, yeah, but it's stuff like, Joanna set up a really cool date for me where she's got a projector in the living room and put like, the mattress on there and candles everywhere and stuff. It's pretty cool that that's a perfect vlogging opportunity because it's really cool. Yeah. But she didn't, and it was a great time that us two shared together that yeah. nobody else would to see. watching it and seeing it. It was, it was for us two. It's got to be quite special as well because you've got a lot of your relationship on camera. Yeah. So it's yeah. got to be quite cool yeah, to look really back on true. that and have that. Managing Ashley, it's got to be difficult sometimes. It's quite, it's quite controlling. Um, did, very I feel like, did, did, did she say all of this? No, she, uh, <laughs> me and Alice, I said a lot of it. <laughs> I agree with, I don't feel like we do separate work and life, but also oh. like who does? Because life oh, yeah. is work and work is life. I, I guess in a normal relationship, you come home from work and you talk about work, don't you? Yeah, yeah but you a lot of come. people, the majority of their stuff will be telling each other what happened what that happened day. At work, yeah. I actually think the most annoyed that Ashley gets at me is on camera. Like doing challenges and like, <laughs> in normal life, do like stuff where he'd get off at me, but when- I'm a, like, I'm a cuddly bear, I'll do anything for her. And then as soon as the camera comes on, he's but, like- But the thing is, it's, it's not the camera itself. It's, it's her. It's like, Joanna not doing good enough. No, it's like the activities, obviously I'm very competitive. So it just so happens that whenever we're filming, vlogging, it's challenges, isn't it? Mm. Yeah. And, and then, but then also you, when you're vlogging, you exaggerate it, don't right. you? Yeah, of course. Then I have to remember when it goes boop and it's finished. I'm it's like, and I'm like, this is <laughs> yeah, it's, it's part of a show. It's almost, for, yeah, yeah, entertainment value. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Brilliant. Right, well, guys, I'll, uh, I've got a few more questions, but I'll be back shortly. I'm gonna have a cup of tea. Okay, <laughs> thank you. Brilliant. All right, bye, guys. We're gonna go a quick ad break, and uh, <laughs> we'll see you after that. Bye. <laughs> two parted question, yeah. and then require both of you to answer both parts. Okay. So the first one, we're gonna start positive. The first one is, what does the other person do for you that you appreciate the most? I think coaches me gymnastics. Okay. And what, like, why, what makes you appreciate that? I just think, firstly, he gives up loads of his time when he doesn't have to. And, like, really, he's patient and, like, wants to help me and see me improve. And That's a brilliant you don't, answer. You don't have to do that, but you do. Joanna gets me monsters when I don't ask her. <laughs> <laughs> so gifts. She gives you gifts. And yeah, well, she, she, she plans stuff and she's spontaneous, like, like the date night. We're hopefully doing something this weekend. Do you not know what it is? She's very thoughtful. I think we're after a, a bonfire. Nice, nice. A bonfire. She's very thoughtful. Thoughtful, she does things for me without me asking. That's brilliant. I'll say something me and Joey was chatting about actually. So it was Halloween and Ashley dressed up as Shrek and he wasn't drinking and he went out, which was awesome. He did that for Joanna, really. Um, and then the next day, Joanna, I don't think he would have ordinarily painted himself no, green, green and gone out <laughs> sober. No, no, no. <laughs> so, like, do you know what I mean? He did that for Joanna, which was lovely to see. And then the next day, Joanna woke up and was a little bit rough because she'd been out, but Ashley wanted to go and train and Joanna went and did that for him. So, that's something that I personally look for in a relationship is that you both do stuff that's unselfish mm -hmm. for the other person okay. uh, and you both get it back which is a really nice thing to say yeah. but that's enough for that positivity bull <laughs> let's go straight <laughs> into <laughs> <the> <laughs> what annoys you <laughs> the most about each other I feel like maybe the one I said on your vlog but you are but getting a little bit better in. about that we're trying like the last what she said on my vlog was that I don't have stuff in at home so like if she stays over there's like there's no breakfast for her mm -hmm. or like bagels or whatever but I, since that I have tried to you make an yeah. effort to be better However, not, last yeah. week I had a car so I had, yeah. had a yeah. food shop difficult with I always find with girls like toilet paper or yeah, or, yeah like or wipes hand, and hand wash and wipes yeah that, like, that, that, that's 
because yeah. boys don't think about stuff like yeah. that. Yeah. And it's all, it, it sounds silly as well, but it, it ends up being like money. Do you know what I mean? Because if you're staying at mine half the week and I'm staying at yours half the week, but then every time you stay at mine, I use all your stuff. Yeah. And then every time I stay at yours, I don't use any of your stuff, but then I also have to go buy my own stuff. <laughs> my <Yeah. laughs> Basically, you I'm don't have to grab the toilet paper. <laughs> I'm just paying for everything. <laughs> so what else? Oh, I tell oh, there is. There is. Ash starts to ask something, then finishes the question in his head as well as answering it in his head. And doesn't And then doesn't tell. Yeah. So he goes, what are we going to... Um, yeah, all right. I'm like, what the... He doesn't even finish the question because he decides that half of the sentence he's going to internalise it. Yeah. <laughs> and then he answers it in his it mind. Doesn't, it doesn't like annoy me or whatever, but I, like she's overly nice to a, a point where she sacrifices herself, be it a time or energy, for other people. So it's really, really cool and awesome. It's one of the things I love most about you is that you're so kind and giving. However, when you go past the line of it impacting on Her you life. negatively on your life, that's what I'd change about you. Yeah. Very interesting. Okay, guys, well, we're going to leave it there for now. One more question lined up, and it's going to be a really positive one, so just end the vlog on a happy note. Okay, guys, I've got I've got one more, one, possibly two more questions. Right. Okay. Um, so the first one is... Who have you been chatting with Oh, uh, Roger. <laughs> Roger. <laughs> me, me and Roger. I'm Roger. <laughs> Roger, um, Roger. And Roger asked when, where, why, what, who was your first date? Our Obviously with each other. Our official first date was at Junkyard Golf. Junkyard Golf. We went, we went talk, to talk East us through 59 that. first. Which is? A cocktail bar nice. in Leeds. Nice, what did you have? I, I tell you when it was. I We had cocktails and some sweet potato fries Ooh. and some normal fries. Nice. I It was when I was in Dublin and I remember I was coming home from Dublin and then like for whatever reason, everyone was away that week. So you were away, Niall was away, and Sammy and me, like literally everyone was away. And I was like, are you going to take me on a date? <laughs> <laughs> like, probably not the best Bye. move. She, she has to ask you. Yeah. Ask her for a day. It's probably not the best move. Were yeah. you go, were you going out at this point? No. No, since so before. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It was like April. it was like the first like official. Sort of, it felt it felt, felt. official. Yeah. The day, didn't it? Were you? Were, so can I ask how, how <laughs> we did you? We were like sign up in the cocktails. We were like so. Where did you grow up? Yeah. <laughs> Do you feel because obviously you've known each other so long. Yeah. You've obviously we've seen each other for a while. This is after LA when you both realised that you definitely had feelings for each other. Yeah. Did you? feel nervous going when you were getting ready yeah. for example did you feel nervous yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. and also like and i like, got ready at yours like in your bedroom in your yeah. mirror but i was like because like, so, yeah. even, even like you know when like now when you sat with your mates around the table there's a silence it's fine yeah yeah of course yeah. it's not awkward but like you know when you overthink it someone was on that day and we're sat there nobody was talking yeah like, then i'm like in my head like we need to talk about something think of something to talk about then the more you try and think yeah. about something to talk about the less you, is in your head and so then it's, also it's, like, it's quite a funny story we went to we went for cocktails and we went to junkyard golf and it was like it was obviously our like first official date and then obviously speculation for so long on videos about are we together are we not together what what is it what is it not and then it was obviously like the first time we were like publicly out together we were like waiting in the queue for junkyard golf holding hands i feel like we kissed yeah. in the queue we got to the front and this girl was like i watch all of your videos <laughs> and i love you both so much and i was like it's real <laughs> But well, then that was quite good because they gave us, gave us free, free games, didn't they? Did they? Free oh, games yeah. And I've still got the ball we used. Oh, oh. Yeah. Well, it's junkyard golf. How long ago was that? I won. I beat you. No, you didn't. Yeah, I did. Um, it was in April. <laughs> Yeah. So this is a, a great question. A, a lot of people in relationships will always argue this. I'm sure the wife always argues it's her. The husband will always argue it's them. Who's the boss? Joanna. <laughs> Me. Who's really the boss? Is it you or is it? I think you know who the boss is. Yeah. Joanna. <laughs> Joanna. Uh, well, thank you, Luke, for being the host. Welcome I feel on. like that made this video a lot more fun than actually awkwardly sitting there. <laughs> <laughs> remember to like, remember to subscribe. We'll see you in the next one. Keep smashing it. Remember, anything is possible. You just... Woo!